Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Victoria Clark, and I'm thrilled to be here at Playbill with my Kimberly Akimbo co-star, the wonderfully talented <laughs> Justin Cooley, to announce the nominations for the 38th annual Lucille Lortel Awards for Outstanding Achievement Off-Broadway. Thank you, Vicki. It has been incredible to see things finally get back to normal and to welcome audiences back into the theater. Our own journey with Kimberly Akimbo from Off-Broadway at the Atlantic Theater Company to Broadway has been such a tremendous ride. We were honored to be recognized by the Lortel Awards last year for Outstanding Musical. And I had the honor of losing the prize to <laughs> Queen Victoria herself. <laughs> no one else I'd rather be. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thanks. So you've got plenty of time. Plenty of time ahead. <laughs> well, now we get the incredible chance to recognize our fellow theater artists, both on stage and behind the scenes, with this year's Lucille Lortel Award nomination. Absolutely. This year's nominees joined previously announced special honorees, Lifetime Achievement Award recipient Stephen McKinley Henderson, playwright sidewalk inductee Ntzaki Shange, and Art New York, who will be honored for their body of work. So, let's get to it and share our highly anticipated nominations for the 2023 Lucille Lortel Awards. The nominees for Outstanding Projection Design are Alex Bosco Koch, The Orchard, Yi Eun Nam, Once Upon a Korean Time, Cameron Neal, Dark Disabled Stories, Theater Me Too, American Televisions, S. Katie Tucker, Letters from Max, A Ritual. The nominees for Outstanding Sound Design are Mikhail Fixel, How to Defend Yourself, Daniel Kluger, Epiphany, Kate Marvin, Wolf Play, Theater Me Too, American Televisions, Sinan Rafik Zafar, Letters from Max, A Ritual. The nominees for Outstanding Lighting Design are Isabella Bird, Epiphany, Ji Yoon Chang, The Far Country, Tyler Michelow, A Case for the Existence of God, Barbara Samuels, Wolf Play, and Cha Si, On That Day in Amsterdam. The nominees for Outstanding Costume Design are Enver Shakartash, The Trees, Sarah Lux, Wish You Were Here, Orla Long, Endgame, Queen Jean, Soft, and Alejo Vietti, Titanic. The nominees for Outstanding Scenic Design are John Lee Beatty, Epiphany, Yushin Chen, Wolf Play, Dots, You Will Get Sick, Arnulfo Maldonado, A Case for the Existence of God, and Clint Ramos, The Far Country. The nominees for Outstanding Choreographer are Andy Blankenbuehler, Only Gold, Warren Carlyle, Harmony, Edgar Godineau, The Harder They Come, Jerry Mitchell, Kinky Boots, and Eleanor Scott, Titanic. The nominees for Outstanding Ensemble are the cast of The Nosebleed, Soft, and Wolf Play. Last year, the Lucille Lortel Awards were proud to be one of the first to remove gender from their performance categories, allowing performers to be considered in their category which best represents their identity. So I am pleased to share the nominees for Outstanding Featured Performer in a Play are Mia Barron, The Coast Starlight, Susanna Guzman, Downstate, Ryan J. Haddad, American Televisions, Dickie Hartz, Dark Disabled Stories, Patrice Johnson Siobhan, Endgame, Maureen Sebastian, The Best We Could, A Family Tragedy, and Eddie Torres, Downstate. The nominees for Outstanding Lead Performer in a Play are Kyle Beltran, A Case for the Existence of God, Mary Louise Burke, Epiphany, K. Todd Freeman, Downstate, Ryan J. Haddad, Dark Disabled Stories, Bill Irwin, Endgame, 
Tanya Pinkins, A Raisin in the Sun, and John Douglas Thompson, Endgame. The nominees for Outstanding Featured Performer in a Musical are Crystal Joy Brown, Merrily We Roll Along, Darren Goldstein, The Bedwetter, Nikki M. James, Suffs, Jacob Ming Trent, The Harder They Come, John Riddle, Titanic, Reg Rogers, Merrily We Roll Along, and A.J. Shively, A Man of No Importance. The nominees for Outstanding Lead Performer in a Musical are Nicholas Barish, The Butcher Boy, Callum Francis, Kinky Boots, Nady Jones, The Harder They Come, Somi Kakoma, Dreaming Zenzile, Lindsay Mendez, Merrily We Roll Along, Marla Mindell, Titanic, and Jim Parsons, A Man of No Importance. The nominees for Outstanding Director are Zai Ali Khan, On That Day in Amsterdam, David Cromer, A Case for the Existence of God, Robert O'Hara, Raisin in the Sun, Whitney White, Soft, and Dustin Wills, Wolf Play. The nominees for Outstanding Revival are A Bright New Boise, Endgame, A Man of No Importance, Merrily We Roll Along, and A Raisin in the Sun. The nominees for Outstanding Musical are Dreaming Zenzile, Harmony, Suffs, Titanic, and Weightless. The nominees for Outstanding Play are A Case for the Existence of God, Dark Disabled Stories, Downstate, Epiphany, and Wolf Play. And there you have it. Congratulations to the 38th Annual Lucille Lortel Award nominees and to all of the tremendous artists whose hard work and talent brought us 91 off-Broadway productions this year. This year's Lucille Lortel Awards will once again be held at NYU Skirball on Sunday, May 7th, beginning at 7 p.m. Eastern. The event is open to the public and tickets can be purchased at the NYU Skirball website or box office. As always, the Lortel Awards are a benefit for the Entertainment Community Fund and donations can be made at lortelaward.com. And please be sure to follow the Lortel Awards with the hashtag Lortel Awards on Twitter at Lortel underscore theater and Instagram at Lortel Theater. <laughs> Thank you so much for tuning in. Stay safe and healthy and have a great day. Bye-bye. <laughs>